Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Sheriff Chuck Allen. It's an exciting day for Incline Village. It's an exciting day for Washoe County as we introduce Marine 9 to Lake Tahoe today. So thank you all for being here. It's an honor today to be able to showcase the newest boat introduced to Washoe County. And in those 20 years, our Incline community has invested in every aspect of Marine program through financial support and volunteerism. We would not have a Marine 9 program without the Incline Village community. The Incline Marine Auxiliary, or IMA, was established in 2005 and is comprised of volunteers who work alongside commissioned staff in the operations in response to emergencies 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. The IMA currently includes 16 members led by the IMA president, Mr. Ken Foe. Ken, I know you're here today. I, I said hi to you when you're on the boat. Uh, these volunteers consistently train in nautical safety, first aid, boat handling, and search and rescue techniques. Mr. Foe was instrumental during the last six months in working with Lieutenant Clark, Lieutenant Jeff Clark with the Wash County Sheriff's Office, and Titan Boats in ensuring the boat was built and equipped to the Washoe County Sheriff's Office specifications with Lake Tahoe and the safety of those who live and visit the lake in mind. Over the past 10 years, IMA has assisted partnering Lake Tahoe agencies, including the U.S. Coast Guard, the Nevada Department of Wildlife, Nevada State Parks, North Lake Tahoe Fire Protection District, Carson City Sheriff's Office, the Douglas County Sheriff's Office, and other California agencies around the lake. The Wash County Sheriff's Office has 13 deputy sheriff and reserve deputy sheriffs trained to work alongside the Incline Marine Auxiliary. Sergeant Spain was our boat's first captain 20 years ago, and the Marine program is currently supervised by John Hamilton today. And Sergeant John Hamilton works for the commander up here, Lieutenant Jeff Clark. About the boat. What is it? It's the, uh, the new Marine 9 is a Titan Pilot T280 and is considered a rigid hull inflatable boat. The vessel weighs 9,100 pounds and was custom built by Titan Boats. It is powered by twin 300 horsepower Mercury Verado motors with a top speed of over 50 miles per hour. I don't think we're going to do any radar certifications on that up here but it has the capability of doing 50 miles an hour to get to those emergencies in a very quick time. Marine 9 is equipped with the latest Ray, Ray Marine radar, sonar, and navigational equipment, and includes a floor or a forward-looking infrared video camera system and equipment to assist the Wash County Sheriff's Office in emergency and rescue operations. Through a generous donation from the North Lake Tahoe Community Healthcare Auxiliary, Marine 9 is also equipped with the Siren Marine Pixie system. This system is an early warning system to alert dispatch and personnel should the vessel lose power, have system failures, or take on water, and also has remote GPS capabilities. I again need to thank the Inclined Village community and our public safety partners for their support and commitment to this program. The North Lake Tahoe Fire Protection District has been and continues to be a vital partner in keeping our Incline Village citizens safe. Right now, I would like to introduce to you Chief Mike Brown, our Chief of the North Lake Tahoe Fire Protection District, who will say a few words about the, our community and this important asset. Chief. Well, good morning and thank you, Sheriff Allen. Um, you know, you mentioned our community several times and we've got a unique community in a lot of different respects. You can see the support we have today and the support we have each and every time we have an incident take place in our community in Washoe County, Northern Nevada, and Northern California. Uh, the fire department and the sheriff's department, um, I gotta say, uh, it's an example, I gotta say to the rest of the nation, how we're able to work together. Um, Sheriff Allen, myself, and the men and women of the sheriff's department, the men and women of the North Lake Tall Fire Protection District, we're here to serve you. We do it together and we have for many years and we're going to for many years to come. Uh, May 30th, we had an evacuation drill here and we're glad it was an evacuation drill, but it was to test the readiness of the public safety agencies, our partners, but also our community. And it went very, very well. 
a lot of participants involved in that. The Red Cross, uh, Animal Services, our local hospital, IVGID, the U.S. Forest Service, and many more that uh, I should have in a list to be able to provide to you. But it was quite a success. In fact, to the point where we're getting several calls throughout the nation on how we put this together. And you know, each and every time we say it wasn't one agency, it wasn't one organization, one individual. It was a collaboration of working together. And I'm really happy that the Sheriff's Office and the Fire Department have such a close relationship. You see the boat behind us. Um, seen several boats that the Sheriff's Department has utilized for their services. They actually provide the Fire Department with our boat that we utilize in conjunction with their program. And you know, um, I gotta say, the different sheriffs that we've had over the years have all been extraordinary, and I'm really pleased to work with Sheriff Allen and Sheriff Allen and his staff, uh, many members who we've worked together for many years, and uh, they do an, astound, a, a, an incredible job. As you see behind us on the distance, there's a lot of smoke in the area. We've got a fire in the South Shore that's over 16,000 acres. It's 0% containment. We've worked really hard in this community to try to prepare this community for the potential threat of a catastrophic wildfire. And we're proud that the community's allowed us to work together to bring a safer community when it comes to being a fire adaptive community. And that's what, our, that's what we're working towards. We don't want an event like that to take place here. So we thank the community for allowing us, the Sheriff's Department, the Fire Department, to create a safe environment. We look to the future for many more successes, and we know they will occur. But I want to say to the Sheriff's Department, on behalf of the Fire Department, we're proud of your new boat, our successes, and we're going to support you from now and, as I mentioned, into the future. So there, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Chief. You know, and just to echo his comments about how well we work together, you know, when we have these big disasters, when we have wildland fires, it's often the fire department bosses that tell us what needs to be done, and we execute uh, orders to get uh, traffic safety, evacuations, road closures, etc. So, uh, thanks, Chief, for being here. You're a great guy. And for the record, I always refer to the chief as the uh, Incline Village Mayor. <laughs> Thanks, Chief. At this time, I would, uh, it, it is in naval tradition, it is customary to offer a blessing prior to the ship launching into the water for the first time. It's my pleasure to invite Father Bill Nadu from the St. Francis of Assisi Catholic Church, who will be delivering the invocation and blessing upon Marine 9 this morning. Father? Come on up. You bet. Thank you very much. Thank you. So I just went to a police graduation the other day. Heard this wonderful story about one of the cadets. He was asked, what would you do if you have to arrest your mother? He said, I'd ask for backup immediately. So I'm asking for some backup here. So I'm going to have the auxiliary come forward, please. And, and the deputies. And the deputies also, please. They're getting old, so we need to recruit some younger people and even look for recruiting for some women, too. So it's really with grateful hearts, and um, I'll invite you to bow your heads, please, and make ourselves mindful how we stand in the presence of the beauty of this alpine lake and the gift of God's creation. Beloved creator from whom all life comes, may you silence our restlessness Allow us to be of one mind and one heart and one soul, despite the plurality of our cultures, ethnicity, and religious backgrounds, as we seek your divine blessings upon this search and rescue boat. Bless all the staff and volunteers of the Washoe County Sheriff's Department who work as a team to save the lives of those threatened by emergency situations, those who provide search and rescue, and all those who assist law enforcement agencies on the lake. Protect these men and women who are at times surrounded by dangerous waters and storms and forced to risk their own life to save the lives of others. Let your gracious blessing shine upon Marine 6 and may this custom search and rescue vessel be shielded from extreme weather conditions. Protect all who ride in her and harm that, that with a, where there is life-threatening situations. We ask that you send your loving graces to the members of the Washoe County staff and their families, that they may continue to support and love those men and women who risk their lives daily. Bless the administration of the Sheriff's Station and all involved in administration who are asked to make difficult decisions at a quick moment. Continue to enlighten those instructors who diligently train staff members, and may your blessings 
be upon all of those who have carefully planned this dedication ceremony. And as we bless this boat, I also want to share with you, I have a vested interest in having the boat blessed. I use the lake every day with my paddleboard. So if you see me out there and I don't have my life jacket, remember who I am. I wear my jacket, by the way. And God's blessings on all of you. Thank you, Father, for the blessing this morning. And uh, now we begin the boat christening ceremony. So if you'd like, I will be doing that near the front portion of the boat. So if you want to shift around to the front of the boat uh, while I head up onto the ship itself and, and do the script. Yeah. 